good spot there. And ingress a second time. Oops. And memory. So now we have two ingress points. And once you set information um, into the uh, data link and you want to save it, you go ahead and do a target reset. And now both of those are stored in there. So now with the ingress point set, we can go ahead and um, set up the attack. So what I'll be doing is I'll have Wingman 2 go to ingress point 1 and then attack air defense. And I'll have Wingman 3 go to ingress 2 and attack the vehicles. So to do so, I'll go ahead and select the first ingress point. See it flashing. Set that to 2 in memory. Now select the air defense. See that flashing. To wingman 2 and then send. Now I'll do the uh, wingman 3. So select the ingress point twice. To select the second one. Wingman 3 into memory. And then vehicle to wingman 3 to send. So all the commands have been sent to the wingman now, so we can send the radio message to uh, initiate the attack. So radio, wingman 2, engage, data link targets. Now we could have them attack a single target at that location of any type, attack all targets of uh, any type at that location, uh, type targets of the selected type at the location, or select uh, targets, uh, just a single target of that type at that location. But I'll do the uh, third option. Now we'll do the same thing for Wingman 3. So Wingman 3, engage, data link targets, target by target. Now, in addition to the targets my wingman uh, designated, I can also do it myself too with the shawl. So I'll activate my shawl. Bring it over a target area. Let's go target over there. Zoom in. Designated. Now, from my data link panel, I'll select uh, vehicle type is ground vehicle, send. And now you see I have a new target here on the uh, Abrus. And I'll go ahead and reset the target computer. And we have a valid target now that we can assign to a wingman if we need to. Is uh, Wingman 2 uh, approaching his initial point? And then here's uh, Wingman 3. And down here on the Abrus, we can see the progress of our attack. Two has hit his initial point and is driving in now. Okay, so uh, number two killed his target and now he's going to rejoin. What we can do is, instead of rejoining, we can assign him to that new target we created. So, I'll select the target. So, the selected one is blinking. Assign him to wingman 2. Send the data. And then go to the radio. Wingman 2, engage. 
data link target by And that is an example of using the data link uh, to uh, send navigation orders to women, uh, sending targets to uh, wingmen, and having wingmen send you targets as well. I hope you enjoyed this note.